What up, what up? What's going on, guys? You boys, welcome back to another Man 25 Online Rank Match. It's okay. You see the title, you know what it is. Okay, I got a couple disclaimers. One, this gameplay is super old. Like, super old. I thought I lost this gameplay. I, I'm going to get all into that in a second. Um, another disclaimer, I sound horrible. I know that I'm getting sick. I sound horrible as it is anyways. You know what I mean? It's not like I have a Morgan Freeman type voice. But when you put my horrible voice plus horrible sickness voice, add all that all together, it equals extra horrible assness. So I apologize. Three, you're going to see continuously popping up on top of your screen that big blue bar that somebody's following. And um, I apologize. Back then... Because this game is like four or five months old. It's really, really old. And um, back then I had that uh, follow bar while I was streaming. And now I know that's a no-no. Because, you know, I um, if I stream and if I want to use any of that footage for um, YouTube, I know it can be very annoying. You're going to continuously see it pop up. I apologize. There's nothing I can do about it. You know, uh, back then I just had no clue. So I really, really apologize. No need to yell at me in the comment section how annoying it is, how stupid. Whoop! This is how old this gameplay is. I was hitting people with bag jukes back then. I was hitting folks with bag jukes back then. I thought I lost this gameplay because when I wiped my computer from factory state, I had it downloaded on my computer, and then it's like I, I lost everything, as, as you guys may well know. When I um, factory reset my it's FMO. When I factory reset my computer, I lost all my gameplay. I just I just lost everything, and this is one of the games, you know. And um, this game took you guys know I show each and every single play. I'm only one of two people that do that that I know of uh, when they edit the videos. Me and God Stumps, we show. Every single play, whether it's an incomplete pass, whether it, no matter what it is, we show each and every single play. That's our way of editing. We want you guys to consume the entire game, no matter what it is. We want you to see everything that happened. Okay, I didn't do that this game. I was, but I did that for the entire first half, and it was like 10 minutes long already. <laughs> this game was a hundred, a hundred and, what the hell am I, what am I talking about, it was an hour and 18 minutes long, this game, an hour and 18 minutes long, so, um, I, I cut out chunks and pieces of the second half, but, um, it's still an incredible game, you know, so, as you guys see, I, I've never been able to score triple digits in the game of Madden, never, you know, um, it's it's very difficult to do, not because um, you would have trouble scoring, you know what I mean? Um, I'm pretty sure anybody who's watching this game can probably score 100. The only thing that would stop you is having, a, having a, an opponent willing to sit there and take a beating like that and not quit. You know, that's the number one reason for most people not being able to score 100. You know what I mean? Because if you can score, you can score, which I've always been able to do. You know, I can score, and uh, I give up a ton of points as always. He scores and ass little points on me, uh, but that's that's nothing new. That's every, you know, you can click on tomorrow's video, you're gonna see somebody score a lot on me. That's nothing new. But another bag juke, and he can go Oh the way. You know what's crazy is that um, if anybody is an OG watcher of your boy this year. I discovered that when I think a top 10 player did this to me. And I was wondering every single kickoff, he was bag joking, but he wasn't going nowhere with it. I was wondering, why is he bad? I've never seen nobody do a bag joke on a kickoff return. This is crazy. He's not going anywhere with it. And then he broke one free, and I'm like, wow, that's why. My defense just went crazy. They just all ran towards the middle of the field, which allowed him to just go for a touchdown. And then... um and of course, obviously, that that's why playing good competition better's your game because you get to pick up things. You know what I mean? Uh, if, I'm sure I've taught people things. You know, going up against them and and being able to you know move the ball or whatever it is. I'm sure people have picked up things on me because I damn sure pick up things from a lot of people. You know, whether it be a blitz or an offensive formation or a certain play or a scheme. You know, so. Shout outs to that guy who showed me that bag juke back in like February or whatever it was. Because I damn sure started using it ever since then. And it got so popular that EA had to patch it. Like that's how popular the bag juke and how OP it was. Is um, It got super popular 
and um, I was playing games, and then people started like every game, people were were, were doing it on me, and it, it's tough to it's tough to stop. But that lets you know how old this gameplay is. The fact that you're able to back juke still and not you know get fatigued. So um, like I, like I said, I never scored a hundred. You know, um, I've scored fifty before halftime before, but like I said, most of the time your opponent is gonna quit. So by the length of this video, you obviously see that um, he did not quit. So I get a legitimate chance for me to be able to score a hundred. And I'm using pistol playbook back then. So um, you know, I forgot to mention you know the teams, but I got the Chargers. He's got the Lions. A beautiful run right there, being able to go on into the end zone and. Uh, I'm expecting him to, to quit soon. You know what I mean? Because he's having things not go his way. From fumbles. Oh, then he hits me with the bank trick right there. After seeing me score like four times. I like, wait a minute. He's on to something here. You know, um, right there. Oh, I almost got the screen. You know, like I said, I really apologize for that blue bar. Like I said, I, I got rid of that thing because I know it can be very frustrating. And um, like I said, there's nothing I can do about it. If I could get rid of it, I could. But, you know, I can't. It's built in the video. So right there, we get an interception. And uh, we end up getting a uh, pick six. So, uh, well, close to a pick six. And we end up scoring. So um, what's, what's just crazy is the fact that... We, we have a legitimate chance. You know, we got 49 with three minutes remaining in the second quarter. So I, I remember this perfectly, you know, and the actual audio from the stream was here, but I had to get rid of it, you know, because I, I play music during the stream and YouTube. We were like, whoa, 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 is that is that a Chris Brown song I hear? The $3 you were going to make from this video, that goes to Chris Brown, and he just may sue you if he wants to. So we don't want that. I don't want to go to court and face Chris Brown and, you know, he's going to sue me and, and you know, uh, me and Baby GS is going to have to pick up extra shifts and just to pay Chris Brown back. We don't want that. So, but um, during the live stream, as I was listening to the audio, you know, um, at this point, you know, people were typing in the chat, yo, GS, do you think you could get 100? And I'm like, I don't, I don't know. You know, I would definitely need to be able to score a lot, you know, because, 49 points from here basically i would need another 49 is seven touchdowns you know another another thing not to go his way we got damn near 60 by halftime already and i'm just like wow we we may be onto something here as long as he doesn't quit and as long as he continues to have bad luck on offense we we may be able to do something here also i'm not sure how the quality is going to be because they have to rip it from twitch so the quality may be downscaled, and if it's a little fuzzy or whatever, you know, again, I apologize, but this is um, an amazing uh, gameplay where I actually have a legitimate chance at 100, so um, hopefully it doesn't bother you guys too much. Uh, right there, another touchdown before halftime, and Kobe got beef just following. He's covering up the damn score. Move out the way, Kobe. Move out the way. 65 to 17 with 30 seconds remaining, and it's a move. And again, at this point, I'm like, you know what? I'm going for it. I'm doing everything in my power to get 100. Now, let me tell you guys how competitive I am. People were saying, yo, just this game is in the bag. Clearly, he cannot stop you. You know, he, he has no idea what to do to be able to stop you. So why don't you let him score to get extra possessions? And I refuse. I refuse even this will be possibly one of the biggest milestones of me, Madden, ever. I refuse to purposely let somebody score to um, be able to get extra possessions. It's, it's just not in my DNA. I refuse to. I will not allow myself, as we throw a horrible pass right there, I will not allow myself to do such a thing because I'm, I'm too competitive. You know what I mean? If I have the opportunity to blow you out, I absolutely will. These opportunities do not come too often. So... Um, I absolutely take advantage of them. You know, I rarely get to blow somebody out. Most of the time, I'm in tough games due to the fact that, you know, as many points as I'm able to score, my opponent's right there in my face scoring right along with me. And, you know, so when I get those actual games where uh, things are going my way, which clearly this game is. I got like four kick returns already, you know, fumbles, interceptions. There's so many things going my way. Like, he's just got bad luck. Like, every time I touch the kid, he's fumbling, you know. And I'm going to take advantage of that because these opportunities, I, tr 
truth, they don't come often. They don't. For me to actually um, get a large lead on somebody. So I'm trying my best to stop him. People are like, just no, man. Just let him score. Let him score. Let him score. Like, no, I can't. It's not in my blood. So fourth down and eight. He picks up the first down. I, I thought I was going to try and stop him. Huge pass by him over there. And he ends up uh, picking up the touchdown. So 73-31 to 31 right here. And we need to score every time we touch the ball. You know, not only do we need to score, we need to get stops. I need to get the ball back quickly because we still got a long way to go. You know, we're close, but you still need to realize, you know, 27 points. That's four touchdowns. And we throw another interception. Now I'm like, great. Now I, I don't see it happening because he's moving the ball on me. He's moving the ball pretty well. And um, I'm having a little bit of trouble stopping him right there. He goes over the top and just, you know, throws a dot. And I'm like, damn it, man. It was like, you know what? All right. He got a touchdown, though. If he does score, <coughs> I'd rather be it quick. You know what I mean? That way I can get the ball and, and try and score. So, you know, he scored on me relatively quickly. You know, giving me, you know, more time to be able to make stuff happen. So, I'm no huddling. I'm, like, going for two. I'm doing everything in my power to score as many points as I can. Um, I've gotten to this opportunity once. Actually, it's my most viewed video of all time, Madden 25, where the title was 100 points with a bunch of question marks where um, I scored a ton of points, but the guy ended up quitting, and I was unable to uh, get that fee. I think I scored maybe 60 or 70 or whatever it was. I was on pace to score a lot, but he ended up quitting. So, um... You know, I, I never got close, and I think this may, at this point, I think this is the most points I've ever scored. So, um, we have a legitimate opportunity. We have a whole fourth quarter to ourselves, you know, uh, I feel, but he's killing me with Calvin Johnson, you know, uh, right there, he happens to drop it. He's going to him like every play. Fourth and 10, throws an incomplete pass. I'm like, yes, all right, we got to score. We got to score quickly. Quick out route right there. Try to hit him with the back juke cheese to try and free up some space. Unfortunately, that doesn't happen. So, a quick inside pass right there. And we try to, uh, uh, that bad you ain't working for me, man. As much as it, it was working for me in the beginning, it's, it's not working for me. So, we get sacked again. We're no hurry. There's only three minutes remaining, and we still got a long way to go. We go deep up top, and he drops the pass. Third and 17, this, this play gets crazy. This is definitely play of the game, not this, but coming up. So, we roll out. We get sacked, right? Fourth and fourth, I got to go for it. I want the 100 points. So, fourth and 30, we just chuck it up and look at the beautiful snag over the shoulder for the touchdown on two defenders on fourth and 30. Absolutely unbelievable play. I was going crazy. The chat was going nuts. Like, we couldn't believe what just happened. And it was okay, just get a stop, get a stop, get a stop, get a stop. So, right here he goes deep up top. And we end up drawing the ball loose by stripping it out. So, third and 18, if we could get a stop here, this would be big. And uh, we got him to fourth down. So, if we can stop him here, we got the ball to 20 yard line. We'll be very close to the end zone. He throws over towards the left side and he picks up the first down. And I'm thinking my opportunity to make this happen is done. But, uh, is Mr. Snaggy on screen? Uh, is Mr. Snaggy on screen? Don't test the user. He is so disrespectful. Somebody please give that gentleman a link to my channel. Let him know do not throw the ball my way. So right now we are one. We drop an interception. We are one touchdown away, ladies and gentlemen. From scoring my first ever triple digit game. Again, I've never been in this opportunity because most people quit. And he picks up another fourth down conversion right there. And again, I'm thinking all hope is lost. He picked up a crucial first down. I'm not going to be able to make this happen. So now I'm just really hoping. Again, I'm not going to let him score. I refuse to. It's just not going to happen. Um, if I get this, if I get this, I'm going to earn it. I'm not going to let him score purposely. So, all right, he throws to the left. Oh, it's an interception, and he's got space in front of him. He could go ah oh, the way, oh, ladies and gentlemen. We are one PAT away from getting my first ever 100 point game. The chat went nuts. The stream went crazy. It was a huge celebration. I've never been able to do this before. The game was almost an hour and a half long. The game took forever. I couldn't believe it happened. Um, again, I really apologize for either the quality or all those pop-ups on top. This gameplay is super old, man. I'm, I'm even 
amazed that I even found it. Thankfully, I saved it on Twitch and I was able to rip it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the gameplay. <laughs> My first ever 100 point game. We got it on the nose, 100 even. We got it on a pick six. Wow. Wow. You know what? The shout out goes to my opponent for playing this game and not quitting because that's a tough game to sit through. He took it like a champ. And, you know, shout outs to anybody willing to go on ahead and take an ass whooping like that. You know, because if I was getting curb stomped like that, I would have offered mercy a long time ago. That's the end of the game. I'm out. Peace. Give it to me, baby.